Yeah, hi guys. I'm just heading home. Um, pulled off because I wanted to show you guys what I'm smoking. Uh, it's raining, so um, I decided to stay in the car. Mm. A few of you may may know or be aware that there's um there's been kind of a conversation going on um well for as probably as for as long as the pipe community has been around on youtube but um but especially lately about um aromatic tobaccos well so Most people are probably aware that uh, there are different, I guess, different levels of uh, aromatics and um, different qualities. Um, and there's various reasons for that. And I don't want to get into all that today, but I bring it up because... Um, I was a little bit part of that discussion, and uh, especially with um, my good friend Mark uh, in Bremen, and um, so we had a discussion uh, about aromatic tobaccos, and he sent me uh, a few v uh, varieties of aromatics to try, and I'm smoking one of those today. It's... Um, It's a John Aysbury 40-year uh, edition. Let me see if I can show you the tobacco. It's just a, it's just a small sample, but I've had a couple bowls and I wanted to show it before I finished it off. Let me see if I can show you the tobacco here. See, hope that is visible. Hope you can see that. So, this is an interesting one. Um, it's uh, a variety of uh, Burleys, a variety of Virginias. And um, some Cavendish, uh, even a variety of that. Um, and then they took all that and I think they pressed it all together into like a plug or a cake. And then they cut it. Um, so it's, it's, um, it's kind of a, a crumbled ribbon cut. Um, with ver kind of various size um, flakes uh, in there, so it packs well. It's um, it's a very nice looking tobacco, and when you smell it, you get a a really sweet, um, fruity citrus but not really strong. Um, or I should say at least it's not as strong as many uh, aromatics. So I would call this perhaps like a medium strength uh, aromatic. Uh, it has a, a really pleasant uh, citrus note to it, but it's not overpowering. Um, uh, it's, not, it's not strong. I had a little bit... Um, a little bit hard time to, to get it lit in the beginning, but uh, once I got it lit, then uh, it did all right. So it smokes well. It's not harsh at all. And of course, one of the good things about 
um, a quality aromatic is that it it's it's natural flavors of tobacco are 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 detected and the flavor that they that they add to it the you know whatever aroma or essence uh, that they want it to have um, stays there throughout the smoke and doesn't diminish or go away and turn into kind of a harsh um, flavor um, that's a sign of of a uh, aromatic tobacco that really holds up and I think this does that I wouldn't say that this is perhaps the best aromatic I've ever had but it's um, it for a, for a nice pleasant um, medium aromatic it smokes well and um, it doesn't leave bad taste in your mouth has a very pleasant aroma, as I said, and um, smokes well uh, to the end. So I think it holds up in that sense. Uh, well, anyways, uh, thank you, Mark, for uh, the sample and the other samples. Um, really appreciate it. Um, so. Since this was a John Aysbury blend, uh, I thought I'd break out my um, pipe made by John Aysbury. So there's a John Aysbury pipe, I'll show you. Has a nice grain. It's not a large pipe, but it works well in the car. It has a nice uh, band and um, Cumberland stem. So that's a nice pipe. So, I'm going to continue heading home. Hope you guys um, enjoy your day. Uh, enjoy your pipes and some good tobacco. And, and hopefully as spring is getting here and the weather is um, getting better. It's raining today here, but uh, spring is here. Uh, it's warmer. And uh, hope you guys are able to get out and enjoy some some good uh, quality um, aromatic tobaccos. Hope you can find something that's uh, to your taste, something good and sweet. Um, so um, yeah, if you can uh, get this and um, the flavor uh, sounds good to you, um, go ahead and give it a shot. It's, um, it's a good tobacco. So you guys take care. and uh, enjoy your tobaccos, and uh, we'll see you again.